We have a rainbow to start the hunt. Let's hope there's something at the end of it. I spy some at good. There we go, look at that. Lovely dactylioceros. Get in. So this is actually a little bit gutting. It could come good though, so I'll show you now. Right here, I saw this nodule and this is from what's called the Ovatisserus band. There has been an Ovatisserus right there, but I'm hoping there might be some more in there. So we'll give this a hit and see if our luck changes. Well, unfortunately, it was just a little piece of will left of it. I didn't have much expectations for that. Well, let's go find some other stuff. Please be a Hildy. And they do usually split very easily. Oh, me knee. Oh, that hurt. <sighs> that really has to be the hardest I've ever hit myself. <sighs> right on the fleshy part too, not the bone. <sighs> but we'll carry on. See how I get on. Luck's got to change after that, surely. That really, really hurt. Oh, my God, that hurt so badly. Just come across this bit of a fall. So this looks promising. So we're going to go search through all of this. And then funnily enough, right at the bottom of my feet. I mean, I'm not sure whether that is or not. Oh, it's a knackered hildy. I don't think the middle's going to be there in that, but it's a good sign. Would you look at that? I just dropped it on the floor and it split open and... <laughs> the middle is there. I'm really surprised from that side. Well, in typical fashion, find of the day was not caught on film. Look right there, though. That right there is a Hildoceros. And if we come over to this side, that's a second Hildoceros. <laughs> that's rare. Really, really rare. Now, that is rare. A Hildoceros associated with really anything else is rare. So that could be another Hildoceros. It could be a DAC. But won't find out until I prep, so. <sighs> Day made. This fall's become really productive. There is a lot of nodules. Most of them are septarian and they're no good, but sometimes you get something like this. Let me get a bit. Oh, look at that. <laughs> a hildy. I mean, it's not the most beautiful specimen of all time, but. I mean, it's not bad. Might stick that in the bag. This fall that's come down here is from a certain layer and it's just left an absolute ton of stuff. So right there is a Hildoceros imprint and there is a nodule that looks like it could contain a Hildoceros. Oh, I need to take my bag off, but whatever. Oh, there is. <laughs> Look at that. Amazing. Oh, what a day. <laughs> watch this, watch this. So... I just tapped here, that's another Hildoceros, but just there, look, I'm going to walk over to it, I've only just seen it, oh, it looks a bit broken, damn, but there's another Hildoceros there, it's not good nick actually that, unless the other part of it's somewhere here, I'll have a look, oh, this looks really good, I hope it's all complete, oh, look at that, wow, that is an absolute stunning Dactylioceros. Oh, absolute pure enjoyment today. This is the most fun I've had out collecting in years. Incredible. Here's the deal. Just found this. There's a DAC right there, and there's a DAC right there. There's a couple of other imprints that show that there might be more DACs in. If, and I mean if, this has them running through, because I'm gonna try and split it down the middle will take this back but this is unbelievably heavy this is pure pyrite and it'll be very difficult to prep moment of truth oh my days it does oh no <laughs> damn so i've just took that big dat nodule away and uh, i'm going to come back for that in a bit because it's heavy and i've still got this next bay to go in what an incredible day and what's really weird is this has all happened since I hit my knee earlier on, which is very, very strange. Not that I'm complaining, probably gonna be bruised underneath, but I'm trooping through today for this. Absolutely mind blowing.